Hey guys, it is Pokey Roll. Happy Monday night. It is so lovely to see you guys. Um, thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you for hanging out with me. Um, tonight is a little bit different. Um, I really don't have any Paladin Fates. And because that was my last um, product that I was going to get for that set. Um, we're still waiting on Temporal Forces. So that's going to take just a little bit. But I have an Espeon V tin to open up that I got for Valentine's Day. Also, a free Pokemon Fusion Strike pack that I got for my birthday. And, of course, our um, chase card for that is the alternate Gengar, of course. And also, I got some pickups um, when I got that free pack as well from where I'm originally from. So, we're going to open that, but I wanted to just have a little side note before we start. So my friend Palmer, um, he's like my little brother, but he is amazing. He's a really good friend of mine. He actually runs a podcast and it's not on Pokemon, but it's on magic. And I have tried to play magic, but it's just a little bit too hard for me. But he's really good. It's a really good podcast. It's a really cozy podcast. You wouldn't think that magic could be cozy. Maybe, maybe you could, but he makes it really cozy. So it's called Untapped Mana, and I know that's definitely not inverted, and that definitely doesn't help, but I will tag him. I will put him in this post. Um, he has, let's see here, there's a link tree that you can go out to. He has Instagram, YouTube, Apple Podcasts, and Spotify is where I listen to him, but super knowledgeable on magic. He talks about all the sets that are coming out, just it's just a really cute podcast, honestly. Sorry, Palmer, maybe you wanted it more, you know, a little bit more masculine, but I think it is the cutest thing. I literally always listen to it while I'm just at work, just doing some work, basically. But yeah, so if you could, if you want to, check out Palmer's channel, Untapped Mana, and his name is Palmer Snow, which... Duh, I already knew that, but I looked at the card anyways. So it said, Most Obscure Magic the Gathering Podcast. I love it. So anyways, there is that. And let's get started with this. Hopefully we can get some good pulls. I will faint if we get that alternate Gengar in po or Pokemon in Fusion Strike. I will say that. I That has been my chase card. It's like 210 right now that I've seen. And I've been, I've, I've literally... I used to work at a part-time card shop and I had the chance to get it and I took way too long to get it and then it was just sold because I don't expect anyone to hold it for me but oh it would be amazing but give me a couple seconds and we will see you in just a couple seconds yeah seconds all right guys we are back let's get started so we have that Espeon V tin we have this fusion pack, or oh, fusion strike pack, sorry, I cannot talk once again tonight. So, and then also, lastly, I will be having some pickups that I can show you guys. But yeah, let's start off with this Espeon V tin, and I'm really hoping this actually opens up nice, and I know it won't. So, I have a lovely screwdriver over here really quick, give me one second. right and if you don't know this about me I actually really love to seal a lot of Pokemon product not seal but keep sealed as I should say so I already have this tin along with a couple other ones when a bunch of these came out so I think there's an Espeon I know there's an Umbreon Sylveon then Espeon again I think there's a Flareon and yeah, there's a Flareon, Jolteon, and Vaporeon one, and I got those as well. But let's open this and see what we get. I know there's four packs in here. Oh my gosh, look at that Espeon V. I don't know. I love I love the Eevee as Evolution. Sorry, Eevee Evolutions. I love, love them. Sorry. Just did that for my camera, but all right, let's see what we got. We I got Brilliant Stars. Ooh, we got another Fusion Pipe Fusion Strike pack. <gasps> no, we have two Evolving Skies packs. 
Yeah, we're really going to have fun with this. All right, so let's go Brilliant Stars. Let's go Fusion Strike, and we'll do... We'll keep the best for the last, right? So let's get into this. I'm actually super excited about this. Let me put my microphone back a little bit so I can open this. But yeah, let's see. And now I completely forgot. Do we do the... I think it's the five card... I think it's the five card so there's that so one two three four five. Oh my gosh i hope i'm doing this right oh i did not do it right but hey we got a right uv <laughs> right off the bat i've never got this card <laughs> oh this is awesome yeah i definitely did that five card trick wrong but Am I mad about it? I am definitely not mad about it. So what we're going to do is, this is our first hitter. Let's get this out of the way, which I should have done before. But let's put this right in a sleeve already to keep it nice and safe. Put that nice in there. All right. Put that guy in there. We'll put this guy over here. If you haven't noticed, so as I said, I like to keep sealed product. I did not notice this. I literally got this a couple weeks ago, and this is the 25th anniversary of celebrate um, a Pokemon, so it's celebrations, right? I didn't know there was a, a hair in there, and it's sealed. That's interesting, but whatevs. <laughs> All right, let's move on to Fusion Strike. And if I sound a little bit nasally, I am sorry. I'm a bit sick, so yeah. Let me get that out of the way so you don't see that. Oh, this, let's see. So that was a white card. Let's see. I can't remember how we used to do this one. So I'm just going to... I'm just going to turn it over and I'm going to see what we get, okay? I know this is not the best way to do it, but this literally around Evolving Skies packs is where I started recollecting again. So, yeah, let's just let's do it this way. Kangaskhan. And sadly, we got one of those white cards, so it's okay. We still have one more fusion strike after the two evolving skies ones, so we're fine. Pokemon is Pokemon, and we already got a hit, and I did not expect to get a hit. And let's put this guy in here. I know I probably should have took it off the thing, but I kind of like it, and it's cool, so... We'll just put that guy there. <laughs> All right. So we're looking at Evolving Skies. I have two packs. We're looking at Moonbrion on these ones. Man, I'm debating if I really even want to open these. Yeah, I'm going to open them. It's okay. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I don't, I don't know. I really don't know if we get something good guys i am back literally my cat got stuck behind a dryer isn't that funny such an excuse but now i'm back <laughs> all right so we got a black code card now i think it's three cards i think it is three so we'll try three and we'll see what happens one two three. Oh, i hope this is right all right oof, that is definitely not right oh we'll get it so oh he's such a cool trainer i like him see what we get oh he's so cute I love it Fla baby <laughs> that's such a cute name Salamance I mean that's a really cool card yeah I kind of like that one usually I don't really see people put them in sleeves but I think I'm gonna put him in the sleeve I really like him. And in my opinion, it doesn't have to be a rare. It doesn't have to be all this stuff. If you like the card, that's just fine. doesn't matter what it is. Pokemon is Pokemon, and anyone can like anything they want, in my opinion. All right. Let's get to the last pack. Look at that beautiful Umbreon. Ugh. Please, maybe me the Moonbreon. Please. Please, please, please. 
Let's see. Oh, not looking good. It's a white code card, but that's okay. It's still Pokemon. All right. So let's try one, two, three, four. Oh, look at that. Finally. So we got that fire energy. Swoobat. Lombri, maybe. Lucky Ice Pop. Maybe I'll put it up closer. Scraggy. Freebots. Hitmonchan, yeah. Oh, man. I shouldn't have showed that. But it seems like something. Oh, no. <laughs> I was definitely wrong. But that's okay. So that was the evolving skies two packs so we're done with that tin so we got basically we got the espion v and we got the raichu v if i'm being very honest with you um i always called it evolving cries because i never really got any hits out of that set but let's do one more fusion strike pack and see if i can get my gengar out of this let's see if we can get them i'm hoping it's a four card that is with this one as well. Let me do this so you guys don't see the card. Open it up. All right. Oh, and then you end up seeing the card anyway. It's lovely, Rochelle. <laughs> All right. So one, two, three, and four. All right. Let's see if it's for this one. I hope it is. Yes, it is. That makes me so happy. The little things. <laughs> Oops. Sydney, Mankey, Growlithe, gotta love him, Stuffle, mm -hmm. alright, got this reverse hollow, okay, okay, oh, and a Butterfree, but hey, that Butterfree is really cool, alright, well, I'm gonna put that in a sleeve too, that's a really cool card. All right, so not the best of pulls tonight, but honestly, that's okay. I'm fine with it, to be honest. We still have a lot more Pokemon to pull, so I am just fine with that. But I am going to show you the pickups that I got from my local card shop. All right, I hope you guys are ready. So first one is a Lapras. Look at that. I was just going to make it go. <laughs> I'm a little bit loopy today with being sick. I'm, I apologize. But Lapras from Sky Ridge. I've been collecting these ones as well. Isn't that such a cool art and background? I'm really beginning to love these e-readers. I mean, I've loved them for a while. I always hated them as a kid, but it's so cool. And then Growlithe from Sky Ridge. Look at that. Look at that guy. The art is just fantastic. A chef's kiss. And lastly, a Needle King. Isn't this one so cool? It's from Delta Species. I love it. Look, look at that lovely shine. That is so cool. All right, guys. Well, that is all I have for you tonight. Um, I'm sorry. It was a little bit choppy. It got a little bit interesting with my cat being stuck behind the dryer. That was fun. Um, also, I haven't opened those packs in a long time. So Evolving Skies, that's when I literally started recollecting again. And then Fusion Strike is when I really got into it. So I didn't really know like like how many cards you were supposed to like put in front. So I apologize for that. But we're going to get better. You can only go up from here, right? And I did want to make one note. I have been saying in my past videos that I have lost Origins. I completely messed that up as I have an Astral Radiance ETB, not Lost Origins. So I'll be looking to get Lost Origins. Um, it may take me a little bit because they usually don't have that in the store. So I'm assuming probably have to go on e um, eBay. Sorry, eBay. So... We'll see. I'm not going to forget about it, but I will put it in my future videos. I promise. Um, just don't want you to think that I'm not putting that out there. I just wanted to let you know. But yeah, so 
yeah, that's what I have for tonight. Um, as I said, I'm a little bit sick as well, so I'm a little bit nasally, and I'm trying not to sniff so it's not gross, but I apologize if it was doing super much, super, super a lot of apologizing tonight, so yeah, okay. Um, but yes, yeah, so if you liked um, what you saw, if you're new in the channel, please subscribe, like, share. Um, I really don't know what this is going to be, but I really enjoy doing it, so hopefully you guys too. Um, I promise I'm going to get better at it. Um, <laughs> with learning how to do the videos, learning how to swap between, you know, doing this and then opening the cards. But yeah, so temporal forces, hopefully I have it next time I have a video. So I'm so excited, but you guys have a lovely night and we'll talk to you later. Bye.